Hello some viewers how are you all welcome back to another video guys in this video we are going to see one of the beautiful topics i will be continuing the converting series so from excel sx to csv html now in this video we will use a vb script language how can we convert a sample excel sx sheet and excel sheet with this simple example id name and age a simple table 1 a and 32 we'll see in vb script how we can convert that so without any further ado let us start the video guys you can see i've already created convert excel sx to csv now what i'll do i'll put a set fso if you're familiar with file system object this would be really good now i'll do a create object what object i can create scripting dot file system object so let me write that scripting dot file system object what it does fso will have all the attributes which are inclined to a file system object now what i'll do i'll create a current folder let's say current directory i'll put current dir equal to fso dot here i'm not getting the methods but if you if we try with vbs edit we can get it maybe in future videos i'll try that get absolute path name will give us exact location where this uh, convert excel sx to csv file is present now once that is done we will do a simple folder folder we will get the folder according to the current directory and we'll get the files which are present in the folder so i'll write fso dot get folder of what folder we need to get of the current directory why we want to get the current directory so let's be create the loop of the files which are present in that particular folder now in order to iterate an object we'll use the for each in vbs so for each file it is if you know that the syntax it is very easy to understand for each in this one will be a file now we'll i'll put folder we'll have an object called files so i'm iterating the files based on the for each loop now let me create files let me create next so in this we'll have all the files so now let me create a if condition so that only i need an excel sx right so i can put fso dot get extension name so extension name will be the extension whatever is present after the dot let's say uh, i have sample dot pdf so extension will be pdf so i need what i need here i need an xlsx file this extension i need so i'll get vbs and xlsx so get extension name i need name i need of what of a file which is in the loop and i want to end this to enter in a loop if it has excel sx now then i'll put i'll click on enter i'll put end if so now once it finds the excel sx what it will do it will then go inside the if loop so i need a path in in the path in i'll write fso build path so build path is a method which can give which takes the current directory and what is the so i'll put fso dot get extension name and i'll be giving here extension name and i'll be seeing okay 
what extension name you need so extension name of a file which is present in the folder concatenate it with dot csv uh, sorry guys we don't need an extension name here we need a base name what is the base name so whatever comes before the dot so my file will get like this sample dot csv so whatever present before the dot sample is the base name so now once we enter here so here i'll create set excel so now i'll be creating an excel object so create so before that let me declare it also not an issue so i can declare excel so after the declaring an excel i can put set just declaring for that sake you can directly set not an issue so create object what is the object we can create in excel so that is excel dot application will be the object creation so once it is created we can create a workbook so i'll put dim work book so i'll write set the same variable i can take so which workbook i need so i need a workbook of this excel which i have created so it will have a method workbooks dot open what i have to open i have to open the same file which is having a format of excel sx now once i have opened it i have to have a workbook dot so this workbook will have save as method save as what i have to say i have to save it as a path in which i have created here for the base name and i have to give a format so this is the formatting for csv we have a format of 6 so that it converts to csv and there are many formats i'll put this one in the description so that you guys can play around the formatting so now let us move on to the video i'll give format as 6 as shown in the microsoft document so i'll put workbook dot close so i'll close it here after that i will quit the excel so excel dot quit and one more thing we have to give here this will extension be a string format so yeah now let me save the file let me open it double click the convert excel ss dot csv now it should be it should create the sample um, this one file which is a comma separated let me open that file here so you can see it is csv file it generated id name and age with 1 and 32 which is a exact replica of this excel which is a table format so that's it for the video guys if you like the video please click on like if you are new here Please click on subscribe till then guys take care have a great day bye bye